Hello YouTube, this tutorial is going to be part of a two-part series and first we're going to deal with creating a um, Cloudflare which is a CDN and then the next tutorial will deal with um, setting up some plugins in WordPress that will actually speed up your website. So what Cloudflare is is a like just I mentioned a CDN or a um, content delivery network is what that acronym stands for and that allows them to serve your uh, viewers content instead of your website server pushing out the files each um, new visitor so let's actually just take a look at the features here um, and they really have a nice overview of what Cloudflare does and they're at cloudflare.com so you can just go to Cloudflare it's completely free unless you want some extra features but um, by default you can just sign up for a free account and be on your way um, now there is another aspect to Cloudflare that's nice is um, the threat control so if there's botnets or spammers um, Cloudflare works as a community and if they block one website then it'll block multiple websites and if they see a threat um, then it'll block that to all other people on Cloudflare and that way you get more um, robust uptime and you don't have to deal with um, bots and spammers all the time so that's what's great about Cloudflare so if you were to sign up, you just have to enter in basic information, nothing really that um, difficult. Then you'll have to enter in your domain, and when you enter in your domain, it's going to update your DNS, um, and it'll pull the DNS servers that your domain already uses, and then it's going to tell you to change your DNS um, settings either in GoDaddy to point to Cloudflare. So basically, Cloudflare is going to point to your server, and then your domain is going to point to Cloudflare. And then that way it can handle the transferring accordingly. So I've signed into my um, Cloudflare account here. You can see that I have my website here, and I can add a server if I wanted, if I wanted to, excuse me. And then just hit Add Website, and it would come up with more um, options. So this is basically what Cloudflare allows you to do. Um, I've seen a significant increase in speed, but more I've seen um, increase in, they give you a nice feature where it says, uh, if I go over to analytics, actually, or analytics, excuse me, um, it'll load up our um, data here, and it'll actually say how many um, people joined or came to this website, and then what they actually were so you can see crawlers regular traffic and then threats and um, right here this is interesting bandwidth saved it'll tell you how much bandwidth was saved by using Cloudflare service and that is a really good um, part of uh, Cloudflare and so it doesn't have to put stress on your server to pump out new um, index.php files each time it can just show static content um, from your web server because it'll download what your server has and then it will show that that way um, your server isn't constantly trying to send its users that information so that is what helps um, traffic and the time that it takes for people to access your website goes dramatically down. That's basically the gist of Cloudflare. If you like this tutorial, please rate, comment, or subscribe. There will be the next tutorial on speeding up your WordPress blog, and that will be using the plugin WP Supercache. So I'll see you in that tutorial, and please rate, comment, and subscribe if you like this tutorial.